چو خدمت کرنک اس جذب سٹھا چھ بکرا تن اس قسم کران چھ بکرا تن اس قسم کران بلن بیمار یہ چھ مدا چھ ام کوئی علم اس حاصل کران As one of the earliest departments established in GMC Srinagar in 1961, Department of Pathology has progressed leaps and bounds since its inception. Today, Department of Pathology not only caters to the diagnostic needs of SMHS hospital but also to a major inflow from associated hospitals along with district and sub-district hospitals. Department is headed by Professor Dr. Ruby Rishi. since 2008 her enthusiastic and knowledgeable approach to the department has elevated the departmental profile to new heights department has acquired state of art equipment like flow cytometry liquid based cytology system mono headed and multi headed microscopes with led screen and much more under her able leadership department has enhanced yearly postgraduate student input from 2 to 6 at present She is a very well recognized and respected name in the field of pathology both nationally and internationally. She has to her credit many publications in major international and national pathology journals. She has been a part of panel of examiners in various colleges. The department encompasses the subspecialties including histopathology, cytopathology, hematology, clinical pathology and blood transfusion. The histopathology unit further includes surgical resection specimen, incisional, excisional and endoscopic biopsies from all organ systems including gynecological resection specimen and curative. Many medical legal cases of autopsy specimen are received by the department. The department receives up to 20000 specimens annually. A dedicated reception counter is established at the entry of the department. where proper data maintenance and labeling of specimen is carried out specimen are kept for overnight fixation and grossed by our trained pathologist in accordance with the international guidelines two fully automated tissue processors are installed in the lab where tissue cassettes are kept for 24 to 48 hours and passed through various chemicals like formalin alcohol acetone xylene and lastly wax for impregnation a state of art embedding station is installed in the lab where tissue is further processed into wax blocks two semi automatic microtomes are available for rough and fine cutting of tissues from the wax blocks to be mounted on slides which is operated by qualified and senior technical staff apart from the routine hnd staining many special stains like pas afb congo red pearl stain mtc van jesen alshin blue are used to further help in the diagnosis A multitude of IHC panels are available in the department to subcategorize and specify a specific pathological lesion thus giving a pinpoint diagnosis to the clinician for proper treatment the reporting of the cases is done by the experienced consultants of the department the histopathology reporting is further subdivided among the consultants in an organ system wise manner on a rotational basis The unit of cytopathology is engaged in routine FNAC reporting along with body fluid cytology, USG and CT guided FNACs, liquid based cytology, pap smears, TBNAs, EBUS, cell blocks and squash cytology. Clinical pathology unit caters to CSF, sputum, semen, urine analysis along with body fluid counts and differentials. The unit of hematology is engaged in bone marrow aspiration and biopsies special stains in hematology pvf examination and flow cytometry 
the unit of transfusion medicine and immunohematology enjoys an important position under the umbrella of Department of Pathology. A multitude of services are offered by this unit which includes services offered to the blood donors and organization of blood donation camps, platelet ferruses, plasma ferruses, cross match lab, immunohematology lab for antibody screening, TTI lab for screening of five major infections, hemostasis lab, component lab for component separation, quality control lab and services offered at Hemophilia Daycare Center. The Hemophilia Daycare Center is another important subunit in the pathology department and is committed to diagnose and treat patients with bleeding disorders treatment of hemophilia patients and administration of anti-hemophilic factors in addition to emergency on-call hematology outpatient consultation and managing hematology OPD, daycare chemotherapy and iron infusion is also done in this subunit. The Department of Pathology is actively involved in undergraduate teaching program which includes a regular theory and practical classes in accordance with the recent curriculum based medical education updated by the Medical Council of India. The department has a robust postgraduate teaching program which includes regular presentations, discussions, journal clubs and slide seminars. The PD students also maintain a logbook of their academic activities. The department is actively involved in teaching dental, AMT, MLT students and interns. The faculty members, senior residents and PGs routinely carry out high-end research activities in the department which are published in many indexed national and international journals. The postgraduate program has been going on in the department from about last 45 years. At present, the department has around 13 postgraduate thesis research projects in progress under the leadership of Dr. Ruby Rishi, Dr. Sheikh Bilal, Dr. Latif Vani, Dr. Mehnaz Sultan Khuru, Dr. Salma Bhatt, Dr. Shima Sheikh, who are further supported by other faculty members including Dr. Ruhi Vani, Dr. Adil Siddiqui, Dr. Gossia Rahim, Dr. Nusrat Bashir, Dr. Fahim, Dr. Sumaya Farooq, Dr. Suhail Mushtaq, Dr. Tazim Jilani, and Dr. Sabiha Ashraf. The department has a vast collection of books in the departmental library for the benefit of students, residents, and faculty members. The faculty members, senior residents, postgraduate students regularly attend and present papers in various CMEs, seminars, symposia, conferences, along with poster presentations at various national and international forums. Many members have also been part of observership program at Rossville Cancer Institute. USA. The Department of Pathology works tirelessly with its medical, technical and support staff for the best possible patient care along with the state-of-art academic and research activity programs in a challenging and demanding environment to contribute towards improvement of healthcare services and betterment of society.